Still I try to be what you want me to be mm -hmm. That just went off for my family I am very blessed I have a very, very, very special guest in the building K Valentine, y'all, in the house Make some noise, baby What's up, what's up? My sister that joined is hot. It's very you. inspirational. Thank you. Um, I tip my hat to you. I don't. I don't know about like uh, all the way from the parking lot all the way up here a million times. I see your grind. Uh, I see your shine. A lot of people might not understand how hard it is, not only as an artist but as a female artist. But you're blessed. I am. You're such an inspiration. Thank not only the women and sisters. But just like to anybody who got it out the mud, you know, anybody hated on, anybody out of Chicago, you know, yeah. and I salute you, and I thank you for being here. I really do. Everybody thank makes you. more. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm here with my girl Miranda Wright today. We're gonna give y'all a great show. Um, I just got off and make sure to all my Latinos. Y'all have an outlet now. Y'all have a platform. An hour before pop radio, I'm going to do hot radio, caliente radio, every week. If you're trying to get some reggaeton, salsa, merengue, all that good stuff out there, you're Latino, and don't have a place to get it out there, holla at your boy. Three months, free spins, free interviews, all that good stuff. Get at me. Pop radio with Y at gmail.com. Along, uh, you know, or the email and gmail models. Latina, same flavor. I'm going to keep it saucy, just like tonight. Models of the week on pop radio. Every week, we keep it saucy. A lot of people don't understand the grind, you know? And I just try to make sure that we all are looked at, that we all have a, a place to come to and say, look, I'm working too. Ain't no big knees that'll use. I support the photographer. I support the camera videographer, the booking agent. It's a tough industry. Uh, and um, teamwork make the dream work. So it's an outlet here every Thursday night. Models, models of the week, uh, artist spotlights, and definitely special guests. Miranda Wright, please, the right way, kick it off with our special guest. Ask for a few, just a couple. I don't want to go too deep yet because I do got to take a quick sponsor break. You know, and I'm running late, uh, but God is good. Ask her just a couple of questions, and we're going to go to break real quick, and then we're really going to drill her after we hear some more music from K-Valentine. Am I playing a song or what? Not yet. Not yet. We're going to go to break. Uh, Miranda going to say hi to the people real quick, and she going to... Hey, what's going on? There she goes. Yeah, we got your girl K-Valentine in the building. I must say, because, you know... A lot of people, I am very much a hard critic. And K Valentine, as me being a female artist, I gotta say that you inspire me. Mm. Believe it or not. Is she tough. I'm real. Um, yeah. Is she tough. <laughs> <laughs> I, you know, and, and, and I'm, I'm gonna tell you, we've been friends on Facebook. I don't even know how that happened. Mm -hmm. But. Um, she ain't my friend. It was a while ago. <laughs> <laughs> it was a while ago. Um, hey, um, you were the car accident. Mm. And. Um, it touched me for some reason. You said that you was riding down the expressway and you was turning on some music and you got into a crash. Mm -hmm. And um, you was in the midst of working on your album at that time. Mm -hmm. And then you came back with this um, solution saying that you're here for a reason. Mm -hmm. And I must say you are. Yes. You are a dope artist. I must say that. Artist. Like, you are a dope artist. I... When sometimes I'm not, I'm not gonna, you know, stunt. When when I get stuck, sometimes I got to go check. You give me, you give me, you give me my motivation, so and like, and I'm like, I'm being real, so you know. Dope. So I'm gonna salute you on that. that. I appreciate it. And one more thing, I have to salute you on, and I can't wait till I get there. Mm -hmm. You perform in front of these big crowds, and I'm a, I love performing. You so gonna do that? I'm, I'm gonna do that. I'm song, definitely gonna do it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna do it. So let me ask you, how does that feel when you come to the stage? It's an amazing feeling, and it's so crazy because uh, being a, a woman in hip hop is, you know, it, it's a challenge. This is not for the faint at heart, as they say, but. With all the things that go on behind the scenes and all the stuff that leads up to that moment, once you are on the stage, it makes it all worth it. 
so I mean it's it's absolutely amazing and it's you know I've had my times where I felt like I wanted to walk away from this industry mm -hmm. but when you have those moments when you connect with complete strangers it feel like you know they really are your family mm -hmm. and the energy that I get back like energy is really transferable and, and it's it's a blessing I love the feeling I'm addicted to it that's what's up I love that too so I know and let me just you know, I might have to touch it for a second, you know. Um, so when you did get into that accident, mm -hmm. I know you were going like, um, how, how did that touch you? Like, how did that affect you with your artistry um, in, in total? Uh, I was just saying, because at the time, and, and, and I didn't crash. Somebody hit me. Mm -hmm. He was drunk, and he was driving, and... Um, he, he was going over 100 miles per hour, and I ended up spinning around, flipping over twice, and I landed upside down in the exit ramp, so, and I was coherent for everything, you know what I mean? And it was, I don't know, it just gave me a, an even greater appreciation for my life, you know. Um, I was always the type of person that knew, you know, tomorrow is a promise, but it just kind of, it made it even more precious. And, and it, it helped me get a title for my album because I didn't know what I was doing. <laughs> <laughs> so that's, you know, that's how I came up here for a reason. It definitely touched mm -hmm. me, like, seeing that, like, honestly. My sister, yeah. she called you a dope artist, right? And I appreciate that. And, and, uh, <laughs> First of all, I said she was tough, but I want to talk about her right now. <laughs> My sister uses a dope MC. Like, you. like you are the definition of hip hop. Um, right now, I ain't gonna lie. Like, you know, times change. You know, I told you I was on vacation for a while. You know, mm -hmm. so I had to learn uh, the trend uh, along with the culture shock. Mm -hmm. You know. Um, I'd have a bigger open mind and um, understand what these kids like, you know? But at the same time, I want to stay like you, organic, mm -hmm. you know, original. Mm -hmm. You know, even though that the beat maybe was Y2K and saw stuff differently, you know? Um, let's stay on you. You're organic. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Um, <laughs> I respect you. I respect your craft. Um, I, I know you won't blow. Thank you. Um, maybe people think she's blown already. Maybe some... I know as a hard-working person, we ain't never blown enough. I, you know I what I'm saying? Yeah, so, right. um, I'm going to get to the whole Tali, Kuali, and all that good stuff in one second. Okay. I do want to take a quick uh, break and tell my sponsors thank you. Chicago Lead Alliance, uh, Worldwide Distribution. Uh, make sure you go like their Facebook page. Make sure you go uh, support pop radio, intellectual radio, iHeart Radio on all social media platforms. Make sure you go check out my sister right here, Kay Valentine, on every project she got. She very Googleable, you know. <laughs> so <laughs> it, I made it work. <laughs> so <laughs> so uh, you know, and uh, I did a lot of work, man. When I came home and I got real connected with these kids at Street Level Youth Media. And not only did I get, get connected with the kids, but I co got connected with the two directors, which is Duke and Lisa. After school programs, man, Chicago's rough, it's hard, it's grimy, it's gritty. If you don't have two parents or you're a struggling parent and you, your kid needs some resources, well, Street Level Youth Media, they're located at 1637 North Ashton, they teach these kids everything about Pro Tools, everything about the camera, what these kids like. You know what I'm saying? So get up with Lisa, get up with Duke. Uh, these kids are dope. Uh, the program is a uh, million dollar uh, private, uh, you know, funded program that just uh, does some amazing things. I got some dope, beautiful women in the building. You know, Pop do that pop sauce where he like to keep it saucy, you know? <laughs> so this tall Amazon right here next to me is uh, Chantel. Right here, no, 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 I'm sorry. This Tasha, the tall one, Tasha. <laughs> and the beautiful, shorter one right here is Chantel. I'm going to bring you to a model segment and all that good stuff and let you know where you guys can book them, where you can guys. Yo, I can't 
and connect with the family. family and all that good and stuff after some more day Valentine. And every and time I'm right rocking for the family, I love you all, you can never see I'm not a for the family. Um, I gotta get it for the family. And everything right I do is for the family. Get into all my sisters, like I said, all social media platforms. I'm going to keep pursuing for the family. I'll be on stage and they'll be yelling out. And every city that he keeps me dressing like, they can't keep Valentine and he's supporting like, and now you hate motherfuckers because I'm watching like, the right way with Miranda Wright, my yeah. co-host who always hold me down. It ain't pop hole in the down, right? Here, trust me. <laughs> I just do a couple little moves. But Miranda, the, she the keep right it together. <laughs> she do it the right way, yes. You know, I'm gonna keep it real. Women run the world. Of you know course. what I'm saying? Right, yeah. If mommy ain't get me together real quick right now before I ran out like Superman, <laughs> I wouldn't be right. You hear me? But God bless all the beautiful sisters, uh, queens that keep us together and motivate us and really represent us the right way you right. know pop is like surrounded by, by nothing but queens a day okay. and uh, i'm blessed you i know? was just gonna say but, that to you <laughs> yeah. but i'm not gonna waste uh too much time i'm gonna get all my queens tonight but right now i i, I you know the joint just went off again uh, that I love, you know what I'm saying? I be, you know, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. No stuff. I'm, uh, hey, look, um, I'm a fan, boy. You know, I ain't got no problem being nobody fan and loving them and supporting their music and all like that. Okay, I'm your fan. Uh, Pop, you know, you can put it anywhere. You know, hopefully you will rest in peace one later, but I never know early. But, you know, like Pop rocked with me, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I rock with you. Um, your lyrics make a difference. Yeah. You, the inspiration that not only that you give in, in Iraq, you know, but all over different communities, little girls, yeah. they can look up to an MC at this time and age and be like, whoa, yeah. I ain't got to do the uh, other stuff right. that's Pop given to you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I ain't gonna exactly. go there. You know, I did, but exactly. can't keep it organic, mm -hmm. you know, and she spit that stuff and, um, I'm going to get to Kay. Kay, uh, <laughs> the inspiration that you breathe out and give out to the world, um, where does it come from? It, you know, it's funny because um, on my album I have a song called Award Shows. And at the end of the song, I, it's like I'm giving a speech that I would give if I was at the Grammys. And I said, I was basically thanking my, my fans, my supporters, and I said, you inspire me to inspire you. You know, I'm inspired by, you know, what I see and what I, you know, the support I get and the people that hit me up. Like, sometimes I could be having a bad day and I'll get a DM or a message like, man, this song touched me. This song got me through this. And Thanks. people don't know mm -hmm. how much that actually helps the Thanks. artist, you know, Thanks. so... I mean, I draw inspiration from, from the people who left me. I draw inspiration from my own life, those around me, you know, everywhere. Let's get to some of maybe the, I'm I'm, I'm gonna ask you. Okay. So, <laughs> you working with, um, yeah, legends. You know, you gotta think about it, cause you know, some people just self claim being a legend. But style street, <laughs> you know, really though, you know, these people out here, you know, talk about, Whatever, but you're working with some legends. Tali Kwali, Icon, oh, yes. uh, Styles P, come on now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a, not only a hood legend, but a real legend. Mm -hmm. Maybe he didn't, it, I've learned the industry now. You feel what I'm saying? So I know that um, sometimes just because you up there, you really ain't up there. Mm -hmm. And sometimes the, in the in, smart, independent artists who kept it organic and are authentic even though he didn't get look like he was way up there and here he was up there he was peaceful and he was fine and uh he made an impact and a difference mm -hmm. and sales people probably be one of them that probably always did more for his people than oh, he yeah. did for the industry yeah. uh and i respect that and again he's a legend he is he is you want to tell me maybe uh your connection and maybe how you came upon not only one of the greatest mentorships of all time, but maybe one of the greatest features and collabs? Yeah, well, you know, I actually, I toured, <clears throat> excuse me, I got to, we did the seven tour together, so it's myself, Talib, and Styles. So, um, 
yeah, we we pretty much toured the country, and that's that was my first like real introduction to Tuskegee. I was a fan of his music, but I remember um, it was supposed to be myself, Talia, and I think was it Riz? Jizza. Yeah. I'm sorry, I'm tripping. It's okay. I didn't sleep last night, but something happened, and we ended up. Um, it ended up being Style Speed. And I think our first, our second night on tour, because the first night was in Arizona, right? Mm -hmm. And it was the second night, and I was just like, you know, that was when I introduced myself to him, because he said, you know, Style Speed got that demeanor, that hardcore. So um, it was the second night, and we just kind of hit it off after that. And I was like, I'm pretty much done with this album, but. I'll add a bonus song, you know. Of course, from if, the if, ghost. If you'll be willing to, you know, get on the song. Dope. And one thing I can say, like, I will always. Uh, he actually texted me this morning. We, God bless him, man. Yeah, Styles P is, you know, you come across a lot of fake people in the industry. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, he's genuine and all. <laughs> That's one of the most, like, when that man, his word is his bond. You know what I mean? And he told me, he said, okay, if I say I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. And to top that off, what you said earlier, he is about his people. And a lot of people will look at him like, oh. He I really respect that. Yes, he has, people don't even, a lot of people don't even know. He's so into health. He has, he owns four juice bars um, called Juices for Life mm -hmm. in New York. He also has pharmacy.com and where uh, you can order different natural herbs and things like that. So. The man is grinding, and he just dropped G Host the album. So. I heard you. I got to go It's hot. I'm a free. I'm a fan of the ghost too. Yes. You know, um, I I uh, got a chance to work with X. You know, X, my dog. Mm -hmm. I, I, um, I got a chance to work. He's my brother now. Like we got a real strong connection. His name is Gil Gilly Delgado. He's out the Bronx, and um, he was Big Pun's manager for a while. Mm -hmm. You know, his whole career actually, his role manager. Mm -hmm. And DMX is too, mm -hmm. but the the kids, Chris, uh, you know Chris Rivers, mm -hmm. Big he got a joint with Styles, mm -hmm. you know. Yep. And uh, we just brought Chris out here for November for his dad's birthday, and um, I've never met Styles, mm -hmm. but to hear, um, no, 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 not hear, forget hear, because his lyrics is dope, mm -hmm. all his punch lines, his bars is on point, just like Jada. Mm -hmm. But to see his heart to give the opportunity to work with um, upcoming mm -hmm. grinders mm -hmm. and local, t that, that, that's, that's something else, oh, yeah. you know? So mm -hmm. my salute to him on everything uh, he's doing and uh, the impact and footprints mm -hmm. that he's left in the game, yes, you know? Yes, yes. Uh, Talib, what's that experience like? Oh, that's so, that's, he's family. And if you see, you'll see him in the family video. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you see him in You'll be here next. Oh, as a matter of fact, yeah, I'm sorry. Real quick, let me take a... <laughs> next week, Tali will be here along with Wu-Tang, Twister, uh, okay. Most Def, Most Def. Vic Mensa. Vic Mensa. Uh, that's on Saturday. That's on Saturday. Make sure you get your tickets at Eventbrite. That's uh, the breaks. Um, yes, they can, it's at the Toyota Stadium. I, myself will be uh, the night before we doing a pre-show with Immortal Technique. I, myself, Prince of Pain, will be performing. Get your tickets right now. We finna turn up. And it's gonna be a beautiful weekend next weekend. Uh, and that's how we doing it. Hey, know? all right. Tell them. Let them know. So, uh, Kay, uh, real quick, because sometimes people wonder, uh, number one, I will, like, stamp this. She is not bougie. Her management is not bougie. Uh, if it's an artist out there, they're like, that they're, they're, they're working. And, you know, they're working hard and they want a dope female MC. Mm -hmm. How can they get at you for book? Uh, they can e e either email me because I have an email in my bio or hit my manager up, which is what I usually prefer. Could you tell us, please, could let them know where, yes. where they can book you up? Yes, you guys can hit me up at itskvalentine at gmail.com 
or only Kiana at Gmail. And her manager, Kiana, is she dope? So mm -hmm. and and she prompt, she gonna get right with you. <laughs> she gonna shut it down if she gotta shut it down. Um, <laughs> and if she sees um, you know some working with uh, or, or to work with, and you're serious about your business, and you're serious about your brand and your representation, and um, Maybe Kay want to look at it and, you know, that's around what she, so she want to work with. Because Kay might shoot that stuff down, you know? Right. But uh, I'm sure if sis say it's, it's a green light, check it out. Kay going to check it out. So make sure you get up with her. I don't want to hog this up because, I, I mean, we, we still going to keep going. I know my co-hosts over here like, cop, shut up. Let me out here. Right. You know? Okay. Miranda, I love you, baby. Give you that I really do. I, I really love, I love you. you. I appreciate. Real quick, I want to send a, another Another shout out real quick to the man who owned the station and, and the the made, it, the made it possible for Pop <laughs> to open up platforms and platforms and make moves on top of moves. Earl Winfrey, Intellectual Radio. Go love, the, not like, go love the Facebook page because that's how we do it. <laughs> but my co-host in the building, I know I know you want to get involved. Um, I do have to ask her um, from one female artist to the next. It is a lot of female artists out here. There's a lot of them just wake up one day, okay, I'm gonna rap. Then there's some that actually have it in them. Mm -hmm. um, what would you say? Because, like I told you, I do look up to you, mm -hmm. and it's a lot of heat. Okay. You know, um, my thing is, don't be intimidated, be inspired. Mm -hmm. You know, Jesus. I have a lot of people, believe it or not, intimidated mm -hmm. and throw hate at me mm -hmm. when they really should just be inspired. Mm -hmm. So what would you say to those people? Because it's like, oh my God, the crab in the buckets are here. So what advice would you give a uh, female artist um, that's grinding out here and striving to get to that next level? I would just say just stay focused. It's a, it's a, there was a point where I would have actually given it energy and I would be answering this differently, but I've reached the point where I don't even focus on the space. Not even, sometimes it ain't even negative. Like, even with Chicago, I used to say, oh, Chicago, this, Chicago, that. I don't focus on Chicago. I just go to New York. You know what I'm And saying? that's where I'm from. I'm, mm -hmm. I'm move, I move around. I'm not going to even waste my time saying, oh, they don't do this, or right. this person hates it. I go where the love is. Mm -hmm. And that's what it is. You have. Everybody days I know, but I can't waste no time. I know that's right. I swear to God. Can you get love everywhere? That, that's what's up. You is. You know, <laughs> um, you're not a 6 9 Oh, you know what I mean? <laughs> you're, no, you're not the most hated. You're the most loved female. I mean, look, I work. You know, I, I move around. My sister work, uh, and the difference is, you know, I, I put it, like, I'm blatant. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I keep it real. My sister just started. But if you look at her, she rock, I'm rocking with her because she'll go get her. You know, and she, she working. You know, right. like, like working, sis, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. uh, maybe I just start seeing her, and maybe she, I don't think she just started, but I seen her grind and start going, you know? So, um, you know, uh, it, it, it's tough being a female. I know it is. Um, it's tough being an MC uh, nowadays because some people don't even want you to be an MC. They don't want you to be a poet. They right. want you to be catchy. They want you to talk yeah. about mm -hmm. stuff that... Um, let me get to this question. <laughs> You're an independent artist, aren't you? Yes. Okay. So, let me get back to my conversation. So, <laughs> you have control of what you release, honey. Mm -hmm. um, you for the people. You, can, you don't have to be... Uh, you don't have to make a certain record. You make a record because you want to make a record. Exactly. You know, and the industry nowadays, when it comes to, it, it, you know, I'm an independent entrepreneur. Mm -hmm. So I mean, I rock with the big company, our radio. I love them to death. I, 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 I'm bought in and I, I support and I'm and I sponsor them just like they sponsor me, just like Earl sponsors them. But I do it with my book. Mm -hmm. You know, and I just want to make sure that you know. What I spend my buck on is quality, mm -hmm. you know, just like I'm sure when you spend your buck now after learning for so long is quality, mm -hmm. you know. So um, anything that we do here at Pop Radio, mm -hmm. 
I want to make sure that there's some class in what we do. Mm -hmm. And that there's always a platform for class, you know, mm -hmm. and for stuff that's organic. And um, your music is poetic. Uh, Thank you. You know, and um, you have a message. There's little girls that I know that rock. Mm -hmm. can, you know what? I was earlier at Street Level Youth Organization. Yo, wait a minute. No, let me go back. <laughs> <laughs> I got people mad. And so, look. Um, pop radio, intellectual radio, our radio, it's totally paid for. You know, uh, Earl, can I get a name, man, that this is a paid for hour with real sponsors on real time. Mm -hmm. So, um, this ain't no hangout. Right. You know, I can't just do what you think, get done. I don't even do nothing like that with nobody, no more, at all. So, when you, uh, I got people mad at me, K, this week, because they knew you was going to be in the building. <laughs> And I'm they now trying they to, they trying to party, huh? now, they, now they want to hit me this week and they want to kick it. You mm, know what I'm saying? Right. But um, I support everybody. <laughs> but um, this is a business. Uh, K here this week. You can be here next week. Just get at me and we will book it. We'll get it done right. We will talk about the most dopest topics. We'll have the dopest artists. Uh, it's all about awareness, empowerment, education, and culture. Um, mm -hmm. I thank all, every one of my listeners. I thank everybody who really cares about what we do uh, from the underground. You know, everything that goes from a hairdresser, from mama, like encourage, like us artists, like now I'm on my English station. I, th I can get loose a little bit. Everybody know pop, the artists, you know, um, on my platform. We go through breakdowns too, you know what I'm saying? Um, it, it, you know, today was actually one of them days. I had one host cancel on me. I told a photographer talking about he couldn't make it at six fifty nine, and we go home live. And uh, you know uh, what else happened? Uh -oh. I, mean, I had a guy that I told, uh, "Hey, look, you got a limit of two people." He showed up with ten. You know, uh, I had a Spanish radio host because pop hood. So cuando te lo hablan español, that's that gangster hood stuff. Because I come from humble part, you know. Uh, so one of my Don Divas that I hired to do the professional Espanol stuff didn't show up. Uh, mm -hmm. So I had every, the devil was at me from all mm -hmm. type of directions. Like, you, today's just going to be bad. Mm -hmm. But, um. Shake it off. Right, shake it off, baby. God is good. <laughs> you know, I got K right here. I'm brushing my shoulders off. Brush it off. <laughs> you know what? Uh, God is always great. You know, I never lost my faith. Well, I was locked up for 20 years. Mm, I great. tell these kids that get whooped by their stepfather or um, my mom, I don't dope, and um, they might got not no money for some good kicks for school, and they got some run down, you know, some old hand me downs. Mm -hmm. I'm still in the hood, you know. I, I, last year I took off for you. I tried to lease Florida mm -hmm. for, for a year for a minute. I did. I mean, I did it. I didn't try. I did it. Because I wanted to go move around, and I thought maybe, uh, but I could still move around. I could still own a house here, and I could still move around. I could still make an impact. Um, I got love for everybody. Whoever don't like pop, whoever don't like my story, or whoever don't like that I ain't a stool pigeon, and I keep a little bit too gutter, or I mess with Cuban Link, or I mess with Kate Valentine, or I mess with <laughs> whatever in political, incorrect reason you have not to like me, God bless you. Um, follow K Valentine. Follow her. Uh, I got models uh, other week. You have a beautiful um, in the building. I'm gonna get to them in one minute. Um, when we come back after these messages, I'm gonna play some music, and these beautiful models gonna give you the runway walk real quick. They are gonna tell you why they so. Well, I'm gonna tell you why why they so saucy, and where you gonna get at them at. And all these thirst bucket ass artists <laughs> that um, wanna holler at them. You won't be able to know where to book them, and don't come cheap. Look, y'all old broke, old cheap. These women work hard for the money. Um, they really have a following. They really did videos. They really go out there and get their makeup did. They really go out there and buy an outfit. They really go out there and put pride in what they do in the hot weather, in whatever grimy situation. Don't be cheap. If y'all following me, y'all, I'm a player about everything I do. I put money in my craft. I dedicated for the fam And everything I do is for my family And every time I ride is for my family
Intellectual radio, I heart radio. We doing that time right now. Models of the week. We got my beautiful sister right here. Chantel. I'm gonna tell you, we got the fire. Look at the candle, baby. Look at the candle. Y'all listen to snapback songs, man. Emo side. Break it down half. We do a lot. Look, if anybody wants to be a featured model of the week, get up with Miranda, get up with Natalia Rodriguez, or email us at popradioworldwide at gmail.com. It is what it is, Pop. You know, I, I did, you know, I was gone on vacation. So, you know, I know the boys. The only way to bring the boys to the yard is by bringing the girls to the yard, you know? So, listen. Chantel, you rocking that outfit. Thank you, you have been chosen to be one of Pop Saucy Models of the Week. For <laughs> <laughs> reason. You hear me? Not the talk. Don't do the talk. <laughs> Come on now. But, no, seriously, sister, I appreciate No, number one, uh, Nomi was here last week. That's my girl. I love her. Yeah, that, she dope. She dope. Love She's her. another female artist coming out of Chicago. Uh, and she's grinding, you yeah. know what I'm saying? For a female to do it in a trap way, to yeah. do it in the MC way, mm -hmm. to do it in the Spanish way, to do it in, I support all my sisters. You grinding, you grinding. Right. That sister grinding, uh, she was here last week, she in Atlanta right now. Um, it's work in the process. Oh yeah. Chicago in the building. <laughs> you know, know what's going on? What's up, baby? This is my favorite part of the show. Do your because, mind. you know, everybody... It's, your, it's know, my favorite part, too. <laughs> it's his favorite part, but it's my favorite part on a whole nother end because it's like I'm like, the models are my babies. Okay, okay because I do manage um, CEO of Insights Entertainment. So, with that being said, I, I need everyone to understand they are just as important in the industry as anybody else right. and a lot of artists and a lot of people that want models don't understand the importance of that right. so i want to speak with you guys and ask like how do you handle the pressure with even anything in this industry um it gets tough especially me being from another state out here um it really gets tough as a female sometimes you work with people and it's like you don't know if they want to work with you and respect you if they want to be on some other type of things with you right yes. and so it gets very difficult um especially being a new face out here i'm originally from new york so no part younger so it, it gets hard mm -hmm. it, it gets the mx the um, mx <laughs> yes. it's from, yeah all the whole locks from younger um, I've been here on and off for seven years. I never stay. I always end up going back home. All my family's in Connecticut. And for all my live listeners, viewing, do you see the, the nose ring, y'all? Okay, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> but it, it gets tough, but um, it is what it is. Queen, real quick, I'm going to get you, because look, we got ten minutes, of, no, six minutes, and four minutes left of the show. We're going to get right to it. <laughs> I, don't, I don't play no games. We, gonna, <laughs> we, we off in five minutes. Sister, you beautiful Egyptian princess. Give us some of the people you don't work with real quick. I work with Lloyd Foe. Um, I work with Boy Floyd, Lock of Films. I work with a couple people. Um, I've been published in a few magazines. I was signed with JD Got Models, but that's... Okay. Eh. Eh. Okay, no problem. Eh. Eh. We don't we don't throw salt here, but you work. But um, Kenny Boom, shout out to Kenny Boom. I know Kenny Boom. I know LB. I know the whole game. Shout out to Skin Bone, Smacks. I've been doing a lot of you know comedian things, a lot of skits with them. Skin Bone definitely has really. I seen the on. one today. That was cute. Yes, that was cute. yes, he's really a nice guy. He really helped me a lot. Can we talk facts? Let's talk facts. Facts. You got big numbers. <laughs> facts. You really work, and that's why you here. Facts. facts. Where's your booking at? 
What you mean like? Where, where can they book you at, sweetheart? They could book me at rebellious um chantel at gmail.com. Um I'm actually working with Dex Millions right now. I'm actually gonna be working on a couple tracks doing music myself so you know yeah. you have definitely inspired me quite a few just you rap listening. baby yeah, I'm working on some things. Okay, real um, quick. I don't play know, no games. Yeah. I, I'm, 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 I pay a few G's for every hour. <laughs> so, you can really spit. Uh -oh. No, 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 no. Whoa. <laughs> can you really spit? Can you really spit? I'm okay. I mean, I ain't as good as my sister. My no, no, sister, no, 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 no. She, We ain't talking about your sister right now. <laughs> I'm, you got I'm, some bars for me I'm, real quick. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. You, you going to put me on the spot? Like, really? Really, though? You going to put me on the spot? I brought you as a yeah. model. You talking yeah. about you can spit yeah. some yeah. me. You want me to spit? Yeah. You want me to spit yeah. somebody? Really pop, That's pop, how that go. Pop, 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 baby, listen. Yes. Okay, I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it. I'm Yeah, give it to me. I feel you got it now. Don't do me like that. Okay, I won't. All right. Okay, let's get back to models of the week. Though. You know, sister, beautiful Tasha. My best uh, you looking like one of the Charlie's angels. Thank you. you know, your beautiful sister, uh, Charlie, Raquel, uh, Kiki. I love you. Who you love me? No, listen. Y'all both are women. But um, Tasha. Yes. How long you been in the industry? For a few years, on and off. Uh, resume, could you read it to me real quick? I'm like three minutes left. Come on, man. Um, I started in high school. One of my fashion teachers gave me the opportunity to do a Davis Bridal Runway show back in high school, and then I did a few shoots from there. And then I had stopped, and I moved to Chicago, and then I got back on my model and stuff. And um, Kenny Boom was another outlet. Kenny <laughs> Boom, my dude. You know what? Real quick, because I'm gonna share this. They don't. Kenny Boom. Shout out to Kenny Boom. Mm -hmm. You've been rocking with me for like two years. These beautiful ladies are sending you shout outs. Make sure you must. He's been doing our uh, events for the last two, three years. I rock with Kenny Boom. I rock with Game Changers. Frank Mayu. Chris Weber, who's doing the breaks. And all the real uh, Midwest promoters, Wayne Finesse. I've been knowing that man for like 20 years. What can they follow you at, uh, Tasha? They can follow me on Instagram at damn, that's Tasha, I mean, damn, D-A-M underscore Tasha, that's Tasha. Look, I'm going to make sure y'all get some dope pictures tonight, you hear me? So, so just follow Pop Radio Worldwide on Instagram and you're going to get all the sauce, you hear me? Mm -hmm. Raquel, yeah. I, even though these girls tie on you a little bit cheeky pica, <laughs> you, know, you still going to be my Latin flavor tonight, mama. Uh, number one, I'm going to need everybody to follow uh, Raquel, wherever she says that tonight. Um, that's one of my uh, Caliente Radio hosts. So, real quick, tell me where they can follow you at, baby. You can follow me on Facebook or Instagram at Raquel Krizna. Dope. Um, I want everybody to make a round of applause real quick. So, this being such a dope show, all about awareness, empowerment, education, and culture, a little sauce. And like one of no, nah, right now the dopest uh, MC in the city of Chicago right now uh, is in the building. That's yes. right. Thank you. Uh, God bless you uh, for being here with me, sis. It meant a lot to me. Thanks, man. Um, I don't like. Yeah, I'm not the other kind. Mm -hmm. I'm the real kind. Uh, <laughs> it meant a lot to me in my heart. Uh, your sister, uh, Kay. I love you. I appreciate it. Um, you guys make sure. A.K. Valentine, that little red button right there, push it, subscribe, <laughs> the, right <laughs> way. the right way. It's K. Valentine. Yes. That's right. Okay, you want to send some shout-outs before we get up out of here? And shout-out to you. Shout-out to your co-host. Shout-out to you, lovely ladies. Thank I appreciate you. you. You know, I, I wanted to make sure I mm. came because I appreciate the love from all levels and I'm grateful. Thank you. I love you, sis. <laughs> that that, that that's a genuine um I'm not gonna say artist. That's a genuine MC, a poet, a queen. sister, a queen. Sister Man, follow everything about K Valentine. I'm gonna end the night with for my family. I love that joint. <laughs> uh yes, I love that joint. And um it inspires pop. And I do it for my family. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I do it for everybody who uh, support me, uh, has supported me for 20 years, uh, five months. Um, I love you guys. I do it just because I can do it and because I, everybody ain't doing it, you know? And um, I'm here 
Stay connected. There's a queen in the building. There ain't nothing but queens in the building. And I'm just a prince, but I'm queens queen. Shout out to Intellectual Radio. Shout out to Pop Radio. Shout out to iHeart Radio. I'm a really rock and rock on this for life. Shout out to the Queen of Dance right here. It's Valentine's Day. You understand what I'm saying? That's the whole song.